Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the deep playthrough of Mankind Divided. We just the previous episode um, explored this area a bit, and we are now going to continue with the main mission objective: meeting with some kind of a guy named Galois. He is uh, supposed to be able to smuggle us to the arc leader, My Talos God. Rooker, I think. Although we also have already completed some side objectives, which gives us, I think, other ways to directly go to Talos Rooker. Uh, it's just nice to um, yeah, explore all avenues or venues fruits and vegetables. Potpora. Alright, here we go. He's on the other side of the market. We already checked it. Pretty cool. Looks a bit like the coronavirus thingy. Um, or at least like a virus germ. Uh, anywho, we already explored everything uh, in this area in the previous two episodes. That trader over there, and we are now going to Galwa. We already checked out this apartment, and I think Galwa, or however you pronounce his name, has his own trading post. Right about that was travel. Over there. Hot dog, cheese dog, chili dog, dirty dog, soft drink, water, chips. Famous, dirty Dave's famous hot dogs. By the way, it's pretty cool. I think if you are a bit accurate with jumping. You can jump your way all the way down over those red lights uh, uh, lamp thingies. I'm not sure what the word is. One second. Just doing a quick uh, translation. Lamp shades. Those lamp shades. Because I already all down below, I was able to climb up on the first one. And then you can just hop, 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 like uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30 times. And then you just, from the last one, you hop over to here. Let's try that, just for fun. See if it works. Polished asshole! Alright. Save the game, just to be sure. Here we go. Oh. This is what I mean. And... Whoop. Like so. Oh shit! That's what I was afraid of. But it should be doable. Let's try it again. Alright, here we go. Challenge number one. Good damage? God damn it! All right, that third jump is a bit tricky. All 
All right, here we go. No more kidding around. Try it one or two more times, just to see if it's possible. It would be weird. Why wouldn't those last ones be different than the others? The damage. All right, here we go. This is where we go wrong all the time. Let's see if I can just save it here. Ha! I jump further over the one that keeps failing. Yes, sir. Right, so I want to. Oh. Sorry, just uh, skip ahead in the, in the YouTube video if this is uh, annoying, which I can fully understand. Right, um, let's just try to jump to this one. God damn it, almost. Alright, this is a new entry, I think. Nathaniel Brown, billionaire business mogul Nathaniel Brown is the fantastically ambitious mind behind Verbaya, a massive self-sustainable city being built in the Almani Desert by the Suntel Group. Since deciding to position Verbaya as a haven for the augmented, he has found himself entrenched in social politics. Brown's solution, the Safe Harbor Initiative. A call to wealthy investors to fund even more Suntel built cities where oppressed groups can live and prosper. God damn it! Alright, I will not try this endlessly. But it should work. Come on. Nice! Here we go. This is what I mean. Like so. Ah! It should work. Come on, you can do this. Adam, I know you can do this. Prague, the capital city of the Czech Republic, reinvented itself in 2016 following the election of the country's first woman president, Sophie Rutsika, pro corporate leadership. Uh, no, uh, the capital city of the Czech Republic reinvented itself in 2016 following the election of the country's first woman president. Sofia Ruzika's pro-corporate leadership transformed Prague into a haven for powerful companies, facilitating an economic boom. New money filling the city coffers immediately attracted thousands of augmented workers. By the time the Oak incident hit in 2027, the seeds of catastrophe had been sown. Prague had one of the world's highest concentrations of enhanced people living in and around it. All right, here we go. No more kidding around. Yeah. Ah, God damn it. I just only need to jump to, I want to jump to the second one, but I just only need to jump to the first one, I think first. Come on. Here we go. Nice. 
Alright. Slowly but surely. Nice! Oh! Oh, nice. A little bit less nice. We're almost there. I wonder whether I can make that final jump towards the railing. Alright, here we go. No more kidding around. Nice! Alright, somehow I cannot save. Why not? Now I can. Alright, here we go. Before last jump. Oops! Ow! Of course, I'm cheesing my way through. The real challenge is doing this in one go. God damn it. But yeah, it's pretty hard to gauge how far Adam will jump and whether he will hold on. Nice. All right, so we did one, two, three, Four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I don't know. It's it's quite a lot. We already jumped. All right, now for the final jump. Here we go. <laughs> nice. All right, so it is possible. So it's one, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 lampposts. By the way, there's like a beam over there. Where does that go? Can I get onto that beam? Uh, not really. The beam over there, I mean. And we can get over there. Let's see if I can jump there from that last railing. Um. All right, the beam over there. Here we go. Ah, God damn it. Let's try that one more time. I don't think it will work. It's probably not an area to access, but you never know. All right, let's first jump to the other one, which is easier said than done. Not sure why. Oh shit, now it loads the latest save. That's not what we want. Ah, this is the latest save. Nice. Alright. Maybe I can jump onto that one. Ah, no. I cannot. Alright, here we go. No more kidding around. There is the beam. Ah, shit. Ah, maybe I can just jump on it from over here. No. Alright, um... Let's just forget about it. At least there is a way up there through the uh, via the lampshades. The massively ambitious city being built in the plains of Oman is proof of concept for Nathiel Brown, the billionaire mogul who's marketing it. Designed, owned and operated by the Satel Group, it will be the world's first 3D printed city, built for and by the augmented. Verbaya intends to run on renewable energy and the zero waste ecology when completed. If it works, Centel will market and create dozens more corporate sponsored cities for diverse populations worldwide. Alright. Alright, see you later, lamp lampshades. And here we go. What the hell is this? Ah, it's like a wheel. Who the hell did them up like a sheep? 
Pretty cool. Ah, there's like a ladder over there. Alright, here we go. Let's save before we immediately hit the cutscene. Um, with like a um, dialogue um, times uh, sequences which I can fill and then I at least have like a safe immediately outside it as if any of us would be invited there besides I'm not sure I could take the desert heat I know Broker says a lot of things, but it doesn't mean he's right. Understood. Bye. All right. I think this is the guy. This is a pleasant surprise. I wasn't expecting any customers today, given the unpleasantness outside. Are you Louis Galois? I am. If this is a referral, may I ask which of my customers was impressed enough to recommend me? Tibor Sokol. Ah, poor Tibor. But how may I be of service? Alright, um... Shook, get into Ark. Alright, so it's a good thing I saved, because... I'm not sure whether this will take us into a cutscene that will lock us out of doing this. Discuss the Diwali's. Um. When I spoke to Tibor, he said you can help me get into Ark territory, undetected. What did he say, precisely? That you bring supplies into Gollum for Talos Rucker, under the radar. Tibor should be more careful what he says, and to whom. He also said you would probably ask a favor in return. Yes, as it happens, I do have a need for someone like you. The police have confiscated some neuropazine of mine. They're keeping it in a storage locker at the entrance to the market. So, for you to give me access, all I have to do is get your stuff back from cops who are aggressively anti hawk These are desperate times, unfortunately. And you do seem to be a very capable man. If that's what it takes, fine. Excellent. I will await your return. I but already... before you go, might I interest you in making a purchase? I already uh, retrieved that package earlier, uh, just while randomly exploring. So... I'll be on my way for now. As you wish. But I hope to see you again. Ah, there's... Two packages. Retrieve Galois merchandise. I read about it indeed being two. So where is the other one? Alright, how the hell do I get over there? Um, level three, it's on. But it's like a separate area out to get there maybe these stairs will bring me there no that stairs goes up Other one goes down. It's less Ah, okay. 
I indeed found a package over here. Then I totally missed the package over here. How could I have missed that? Ah, there it is. Right. That went easy enough. If you know anything about the Rosica bombing, say something. Here we are. Save the game again. Another one. This one. Welcome back. Have you brought with you the article we discussed? Here you go. Excellent. In return, I will unlock the security door at the back of this room. Beyond that, you'll find a ladder which will take you where you want to go. Thank you for your assistance. Pleasure was all mine. So what do you expect? Understood. Right, but now also let's talk Welcome with Welcome back. How may I help you this time? Discuss the Diwalis. Let's talk about the Diwali crime family. Who are they? They're the people running organized crime in Prague. Their second in command is a man named Otar Botkevelli. Heard of him? No. I'm sorry, I haven't. Well, that's too bad. I was hoping you could tell me why he wants me to kill you. Shit! He wants me dead? Drug son of a bitch! Sounds like you're starting to remember him now. Yeah, yeah, Otar. He just slipped my mind for a moment. That's not the only thing slipping. Fine, smart guy. I work for Otar's boss, the head of the Diwali family, Radic Nikolazzi. I spy on Otar's activities for Radic. Shit, I just realized the other Pachyan, Constantine, he died in the train station bombing. You're thinking Otar wants to get the second spy, you, out of the way and make a move against Radic. I'm sure he'd love it. Those two have had their own private Cold War going on for years. But still, getting rid of me and Constantine wouldn't be enough. Otar needs to gather more support in Prague and in Georgia. But he could do it. The only thing keeping him from consolidating his power is... Well, me? But you're not really planning to kill me, are you? Right, this one. No, I draw the line in assassination for would-be mob bosses. Thank you. Thank you. What can I do to repay you? Name it. Anything. Vaclav Kohler. What's his connection to Radic? Wait, I can't tell you that. Radic would kill me. You said anything. Unless you'd prefer the alternative. Damn it. Okay. Radic, Kohler, and I have a trilateral arrangement. Radic has an augmented leg. You just became the fifth living person to know that. So, I get Radic his neuropazine and Kohler maintains his leg. In return, Radic looks out for us. He's not doing a great job of that. You're lucky Otar sent me instead of somebody else. He won't stop with you either. I'd better get out of the country until this blows over. And I'll guess I'll have to retire the Louis Galois persona. Oh well, I had fun playing him. Next time, try it with a French accent. Might be more credible. Well, before we say our goodbyes, can I perhaps interest you in any of Louis Galois' remaining wares? Right, apparently he pays more for certain items. Let's see what you've got for sale. Let's see of course. Please take a look. Anything to sell? Uh, this one. Yeah, for the wrists, I 
actually prefer to keep all my crap because I'm not sure whether a boss fight will be coming up. Um, let's see how we go on ammunition. Yeah, 36 shotgun and EMP and 60 regular, that's more than enough. Combat rifle, 200 regular, 56 armor. 22 regular that is more than enough um, regular pistol 100 124 EMP also more than enough yeah, and then we have like battle rifle I don't have the battle rifle but I will save this for the battle rifle back in Adam's apartment uh, 16 bio cells more than enough Seven hyper stims, four multi tools. Man, I have a lot of crap. No, I will just leave it be. Let's see what he has uh, for sale. A scope. Yes. Do I need more silencers? By the way, not really. Let's buy a. Scope for the battle rifle, one why not? Let's just buy also another silencer. Combat rifle, no, I already have one, right? Pretty sure I do. Pistol I have. Sniper rifle, I cannot carry. I wonder, is a sniper rifle the same as a battle rifle with a scope? Uh, no, they're a little bit different looking. Alright. Um, yeah, I will buy that later. Tranquilizer rifle, I have it back. In Adam's apartment, battle rifle, I think as well. Or a tranquilizer rifle, I'm not sure whether I have a sniper rifle, but I do have a tranquilizer and battle rifle, I think. Machine pistol I have, tactical shotgun I have, yeah, so let's just leave it at this. Are you certain? I'll be on my way for now. As you wish, but I hope to see you again. Proper channels. Machiavelli, it's Jensen. Your problem in the Udalek complex has been taken care of. Good. I look forward to hearing the details. But I will have to wait, because I have other urgent matters keeping me busy at the moment. I will call you back shortly. Right. I could have also just take them all out and get all their stuff. But yeah, that's not how Adam rolls. Um, let's see if I can immediately upgrade one of the weapons. Uh, what did I have? I have a silencer. Yeah, I want to use that silencer for the sniper rifle, actually. And a times four scope. Yeah, I'm not even sure I need that. If it's already, if I buy a sniper rifle, it already has a scope. I don't want to have like a sniper rifle scope on any other weapons than the sniper rifle. Four times weapon scope comes with a low profile tactile style elevation turrets. The multi coated lenses offer maximum clarity and edge to edge sharpness. Its telescopic sighting device, equipped with a times four optical magnification and crosshairs, is designed to extend the user's effective range. This attachment is compatible with most weapons on the market, makes it much easier to hit a target at long range. Alright, let's see indeed. Nah, I can only put it on this one, but I don't want to put it on the combat rifle. So let's leave it for now and let's leave the silencer as well. Alright, so far so good. Now we have three ways to get into the um, arc complex, I think. 
we can go talk to Lubas, we can uh, use the elevator cards, or we can just enter it where from the ladder where we are now. Let's do that ladder one. Or maybe, can I also... Uh, I'm just curious. Let's just talk to that guy and see what happens. Let's explore all the three options. Ramp can fall and kill or injure personnel. What ramp? I don't really see a ramp. Um, that guy. Serious. So let's explore all the options. We can use the key card, we can talk to the guy, or we can take the stairs up uh, where we just came from. Let's see if we can just use that key card here without the guy worrying. Yes, we can. Oh. Here, use t -Bus card in the elevator. Elevator must come, right? Oh shit! Alright, now let's talk to this guy. That is the other option. If it's still available. The revolution awaits, brother. Go on up. The revolution awaits, brother. Go on up. All right. He is not really saying that much. Let's see. What happens if we first talk with him and then use the key card? Probably nothing more, but you never know. That already did all the. Man, this loads in so slow. Yes, we have everything, the silencer and stuff. Alright, here we go. Yes. Is there something I can help you with? You're Lubosh, right? Dushin Sokol told me Ark might have the answers I'm looking for. He sent me to you. Dushin? I heard the police had him and his brother Tibor locked up in the Narrows. Yeah, the cops were working Dushin over pretty good when I found him. Wasn't exactly a fair fight, so I stepped in. Is he okay? He'll be fine. Looking forward to sleeping in his own bed tonight. Not a lot of people in here would be bothered to stop and help out the stranger. What was happening wasn't right. You took on the police by yourself, on their own turf? And then Dushin pointed me to you. He was right to do so, but I'm sure he would have given you something more. Some wisdom, maybe? Um, This one. When you've robbed a man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's free again. Spoken like a true brother of the revolution. I think I even heard conviction in your voice. I'll unlock the elevator for you. Go on up. All right, I just want to do one Great, thing. Uh, just for fun, see what the other options were, whether, whether they are like uh, also serious uh, sayings or proverbs or whether they really made them like super funny. So let's quickly do that over. Right. 
there something I can help you with? You're Lubosh, right? Dushin Sokol told me Ark might have... Dushin? I heard the pol... Yeah, the cops were working do... Is he your... He'll be fine. Looking forward to... Not a lot of people in here would be... What was happening wasn't right. You... And then... He was right to do so. Alright, so this is the one we uh, need to take. When you've robbed the man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's free again. Alright, after you take everything, a man is robbed of what makes him free. Before he's free again, a man needs to rob everything. <laughs> that's, that's what I mean, that's pretty funny. After you take everything, a man is robbed of what makes him free. Alright, here we go. When you've robbed a man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's free again. Spoken like a true brother of the revolution. I think I even heard conviction in your voice. I'll unlock the elevator for you. Go on up. Alright, let's talk a bit with him. How did you get involved with Ark? I used to load freight for the Czech Railway in Ostrava. After the incident, my employers were afraid of me. I was fired. So like most of the augmented in the country, I drifted into Prague, unlicensed and homeless. The police swept me up in a sewer raid one night, put a round in my leg and dumped me here. It wasn't long before Talos found me. And he gave you work? He gave me purpose. He's the reason I'm still alive. What can you tell me about Talos? The first time I met him, he's cutting a bullet out of me while trying to explain the history of the Gulag. He has his hand stuck in my leg and is encouraging me to study Stalinist labor camps. Three months later, I pass him in the throat and he says, Lubosh, how's the leg? Are you studying the Gulag like I suggested? Remembered me like it was yesterday. Sounds like he has a good memory. No, I matter to him. Me, a nobody, matter to a great man like Talos Rucker. That's the kind of man he is. Dushin said some of the police are using the Ruzika bombing as an excuse to hurt the augmented in Gollum City. Why do you think that is? They're trying to manufacture a response from Talos to get Ark to fight back. Violence begets violence. That's right. And if Ark responds violently, then their case against us only builds. But <laughs> Talos is too smart. He won't allow Ark to be baited into a false confession, even if it means that the people we've sworn to protect are hurt. Alright, I think Ark is a pretty good organization. Great, thanks. Alright, now I cannot... Ah, secondary, use Tibor's card in the elevator. Somehow that also cleared now. Alright, but now the question is... How do I want to get up? Through the, with the ladder or through the Galois... Louis Galois is willing to get me into our territory provided I do him a favor. First, the cops are holding his neuropocene shipment in a locker near the entrance to the market. Looks like I have some covert hacking to do. I successfully hacked into the police storage locker and retrieved Galois' confiscated merchandise. Now I just have to give the neuropocene to him to complete my end of our deal. Get his key cards. Use the key cards. Talk to Lubas. Uh, find Tibor in the Narrows. We already did it. Go to Sokol's apartment. Yes. Um, I will. Yeah, it doesn't really matter, I think. I will just go with the. See where that stairs leads, and otherwise, I will come back and take the elevator. But it probably. Both leads eventually up to the same area anyways. Welcome back. Are you here to make a purchase? Let's see if there's would certainly be useful when I'm running for my life. Whether there's more dialogue? I doubt it. No. I'll be on my way for now. As you wish. But I hope to see you again. What do we have here?
Allah. As if but any of us would be invited there. Barrel so, or some kind I'm of. I'm not uh, sure I could take the desert heat. Strengthening. Only the best and the brightest, right? Records. So pretty cool. All these oak stuff. These are like. Don't be stupid. You know what's going on. What's on the line? Spinal uh, thingies. Wait, what's the word of that? One moment. There isn't a damn thing we can do about it. Not through proper channels, as they say. Go ahead. As if any of us will be invited there. Besides, I'm not sure I could take the desert heat. Um. Only the best and the brightest, right? Okay, see you later. Vertebra. This looks a bit like vertebrae. Uh, Alright, nice guns. The sniper rifle looks pretty badass. I cannot deny that. And compared to the battle rifle, where is the battle rifle? There isn't a damn you thing we can do about it. Why it's similar? Channels, I know, Rooker says a lot of things, but it doesn't mean he's right. Alright, anything else here? I know. Rooker says a lot of things, but it nope. doesn't mean he's right. Right. Um, hitting the 40 minute marker will Jensen, have to... getting lonely up here. Got an update for me. Yeah. I discovered that favors are like currency in Gollum City. We're back on track. I'm heading for an area called the Throat now. Should take me straight into Ark territory. Good. I'll update Miller and do a flyby up ahead. Get you the lay of the land. Copy that. Right. Thank you very much. And there was also something in there. Um, guys, we'll continue in the next one. I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you there. For the meantime, do not forget, always do keep on gaming. See you later.